everybody. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. We have an experiment for you. It is so cold right now, but tonight it is supposed to get even colder. It is supposed to drop to 27 degrees with a chill factor of 24. It is going to be freezing. We have set up over here some different containers and buckets of different sizes. We are going to fill each of them with water. We're going to let them sit overnight. I have a little uh, temperature gauge here. I'm going to let you know what the water temperature is. Show them what the pans are right now. Oh my gosh. Wait. There. 36. All right, hit the tub. 38. Did it focus? Yeah. 38 degrees on the side of the tub. Let me say, look at the plastic one. On the... And the side of the plastic container, 40. All right, let's put some water in them. Okay. <laughs> it's cold. In this summer, we can be 110, 105, 110. So we never get cold like this, so we're going to play. Yeah, and see which levels of water freeze and how thick the frozen section gets. I may be ice skating on this one in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Little pirouette. <laughs> Let's make that one deep. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. It's Friday night. Sun has gone down. How full are we, full are we gonna make that one? This one I'm gonna take up to this line right here. Okay. This one will take the longest, obviously. It's cold out here, but it feels refreshing because it's like crisp, clean air. It's been breezy here all day, so the air is like fresh. Should I dump it on her? No, oh no, that wouldn't feel fresh at all. Where's the temperature gauge? The water's gotta probably be in the 50s. Okay. I don't know why I can't get it. Water is 54 point, yeah, about 54 degrees. Oh my gosh. We're going to make ice. Yes, we are. All right, consensus okay. is that water is about 54 degrees. All right. Okay. We're gonna leave these overnight. We'll be back in the morning to see which ones froze. Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> see you in the morning. We <laughs> gotta go in the warm house. What are you? What is she? <laughs> Her teeth. Seventy. I can't really read it. Hope they can see it on there. It's almost eighty, I think. That's too Understand? cold. <laughs> All right. <sighs> okay, it's Saturday morning. It what is 6.50 a.m. and it is 34 degrees. We have some frost up on the top of our shed. Frost. The solar panels are frozen. Yes, they are. Frost on the grass. The grass is really, really crunchy. We actually just realized this is our first same day video because as soon as we're finished filming this, it's gonna, we're gonna go up, Bill's gonna finish it and post it so you'll be seeing. So we came outside, saw that everything else is all crunchy and frosty. And as far as our water is concerned, this tin that has the least amount of water, it is frozen solid. See if you can get it out of there. In the oh, tin. look at the bubbles. Can you see the bubbles? Oh, yeah, look at that. That's really cool. Let me see if I can get... Look. <laughs> <laughs> so there's some water in there that isn't quite... But, I mean, it's... Let me it see is, if I can get it out of there. Take the camera. Oh, this is frozen. Yeah. Oh, it is frozen. Wow, oh, I'm look cracking you cracked it. it. Is it focusing? Yeah.
Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. It's rock candy. Yep. So that was a win. Oh, definitely. All right, there's a, that there's was ice. ice. So a thin, so a thin um, sheet of water froze. Definitely. All right, let's go to the next one. So this is the next I think one. The, I think the metal tin helped. Yes, I think so too. Oh, can you see that big bubble in there? One yeah. big bubble. I mean, this one is, it is pretty solid, but you can see that it didn't quite freeze all the way through. It's just going to layer on the top. Look, can you see this little thing? And it's, I can bring water up. Yeah. Oh, there it went. There it went. So it had about a thin, oh, look at that. That is pretty cool. It is pretty cool. Can you focus on how thick it got actually? That's yeah. really pretty thick for only overnight one night. Let's try this one right here. Okay. Oh, look. Oh no, it's pretty slushy. It's just trying to freeze, but it's too much water. Yeah. Oh, it has a very thin. Oh yeah, it's like slushy. It's like slushy. It's like it hasn't quite had the opportunity to finish freezing. But look, you can see. Look at yeah. all that. Yeah, there was a little bit starting. <coughs> too much water, so the rest of these I don't think are going to freeze. But look how look Is how milky this too? looks though. I mean, this one looks thicker even. Oh yeah, look. Oh yeah, we this got some ice. This one actually had a layer of ice. This one's pretty thin, or pretty shallow, but nope, same thing. I think you're right, the, uh, the tin. Too much water, the water couldn't drop. Yeah, helped the, also. the metal got colder. Well, there's a nice cool bath. Oh, it does have like a fine layer of ice that? on the top. The top, yeah. Yep. But we don't have a block of ice. No. All right, that's pretty fun for us. Yeah, that was really awesome, actually. I'm really surprised at how thick the layer got on those, and I think it helped that it was in the tin. The tin must have been able to get colder in the night and make a thicker. <laughs> I can't believe you're outside. It's like 34. I know it's so cold. My hands are so cold. Anything for a video. <laughs> this was a fun experiment though to figure out. I liked it very much. I hope you guys enjoyed our video. I hope you learned something. Um, it was kind of fun to do because this is the coldest night that we've had so far. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Bye. That's California's use of warm <laughs> everyone else in the rest of the world. They go, wow, ice. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>